Hey there, YouTube. Welcome to Drake Array Gaming. Today, we're going to be talking about driver installation and how to do it the right way. As usual, no BS, no fluff. Here we go. All right. First thing we want to do is go ahead and check out what you got going on with your system. Go ahead and type device manager. Then you want to click here, open it up, go to display adapters, expand that. Here's my RTX 3080. And what you can do here from here without using the NVIDIA panel, the ATI panel, is you can manually uninstall this device driver update, whatever. But um, this is if you want to hard go ahead and rip that driver out and then reinstall the new one. But before we go there, we just kind of wanted to see what was going on. Maybe check, go to the properties, check our driver version, get the information we need. But now you can run and go ahead and open up your GeForce experience. Make sure the app itself is updated. Go ahead and check your up, check for updates on the driver here. Um, it'll let you know. So like mine's obviously the latest driver already. Um, it does have a reinstall driver option here, but that doesn't always work. And really, it doesn't give you an option uh, that I can see anywhere here to to uninstall your driver. Um, you can also set it to download studio drivers or game ready drivers, which is a difference. Um, so in here, it's, it's, it's a little bit difficult because it doesn't really tell you where and how and and what you can actually do to uninstall this driver. So a lot of times, what I like to do is get to the core of it and go to the Windows core settings itself and uninstall the driver here. And you can simply right click on it, click uninstall this device. Um, and when you do that, what you want to do is check this box to remove the drivers and devices and delete them, all of them out of there. And what I recommend you do is then reboot. When you reboot, your graphic settings may look a little wonky. Um, and then what you want to do is not really go back into here to update and or do the driver. What you want to do is go into GeForce Experience and install, reinstall from here. And then I would recommend rebooting after that again. Um, what you can also do is go online, go to the NVIDIA drivers search. If you're looking for a specific driver, there's an official advanced driver search and I can link this down below. Uh, but it's nvidia.com slash download slash find. And you can search for exactly the type of product series and driver type you're looking for uh, and get an, uh, get an exact version. So let's just do like a quick search here. And so if I'm looking for a specific version, which you obviously can check in your uh, device manager, I'm gonna go back in there real quick. So you can obviously go here and check in the driver's detail tab for the exact version that you're running. Um, and you can find a version that worked maybe better uh, for you in the past or et cetera. And then you can download this version separately. And I'll go ahead and just kind of show you what that looks like now. Go to the download page, click download, get that version, go ahead and navigate to where it downloaded. And what you want to do is actually run this installer uh, run as administrator if you want, um, but run this installer instead of running the GeForce experience because the GeForce experience is going to be the latest one. Then you can actually run a specific version that maybe fixes an issue with your game because not always the latest is the greatest and reinstall that, then reboot, and then you should be good to go after that. This is the proper way and procedures and tools you should be using to install a driver. I hope this quick video helps you out on how to properly install and uninstall slash reinstall your graphics drivers. I'm Drake Array here to help the gaming community and I'll see you next time.